here with Tennessee's first commitment for the 2022 class, Elijah Herring, the first commitment of the Josh Heupel era. Elijah, how's that sound? That sounds great. I love it. So, so when you decided on Tennessee, take me through the decision. What sold you on Tennessee? I know Michigan has made a run at you the last couple of months, and you picked them. You picked Tennessee over over the Wolverines. What 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 made Tennessee the right fit for you? So it was uh, we had, we had a meeting with them last Wednesday. So they was giving us a virtual tour, a virtual tour tour of the facility. And at the end of the facility, I talked to all the coaches, and they and they just told me about family and. And they talk about they talked about God and how they can use me in their schemes and their program and how everything was just family oriented and how we and how they all knew each other from past years and how they could just make the program great again. So the coaching staff I know is one that, as you just referenced, they've got a lot of continuity there. Um, defensively, what did you like about? Coach, you know, Brian and then, then and then Coach Eckler, you know, I know both those guys have been recruiting you pretty hard. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. They they've been telling me a whole bunch of stuff, like how they can use me in pass rest, how they can get me dropped back. And they've just been telling me that the defense is very physical, that they're gonna get out there this year and they're gonna try to make a whole bunch of turnovers and interceptions. So where do they envision you playing and, and what did they kind of sell you on as far as your role? Um, they envision me playing middle linebacker, but also switching out positions and getting some pass rush in because they still he said they he said I'm very good at using my hands. So they said they still want me to get in there. Break down your game a little bit. And while we're talking here, we're gonna play some some of your, your highlights from Riverdale. What do you feel like you bring to the table and where does your game gotta to continue to get better? Well, what I bring to the table is a guy that can get to the quarterback, a guy that could a guy that can get off the ball very quickly, get off the ball faster than others, then somebody who can use their hands very great, then somebody who can recognize. But I do also think my game can get better at most likely reading the player that I'm going against and also also knowing what I can do to stop the defense. Do you feel like I mean, your best do you feel like your best football's ahead of you? Yes, sir. What makes you say that? Cause there's new things that I see. So the the player that I look up to most is Von Miller. So I watch him a lot. And then I watch some college guys. And I know that I can do that, do that type of stuff one day too, as long as I work on my craft. You also got the glasses like Von Miller does. Yes, sir. <laughs> when you first saw that, was that something that you're like, hey, look at that? Yeah, he he really he really got me started on the glasses because I saw that he had a whole like shelf of glasses. So I was like, yeah, I need that. I need to be like that guy. So, how, you know, first commitment of the Josh High player, when, you know, what kind of, you know, players, I know you've got several on your seven on seven team, you'll be uh, leaning on and, and trying to get to come with you. You know, will you be pretty vocal about that? I know you're more of a reserved kid, but do you think you've got that in you to kind of pick up the phone and say, hey, I need you to, you know, to come to Tennessee with me? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Anything from Coach Hype. I'm going to get them out there. Try to get a whole bunch of guys coming. So, any anybody in particular you go target on your seven on seven team? Because I mean, there's a few that Tennessee wants. I mean, Cam Miller, Isaiah, mm-hmm. Isaiah Horton, Dallin Hayden. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna try to start on Dallas first. That makes sense. <laughs> yes, sir. Well, Elijah, we appreciate it. Next time you head up to Knoxville, which will be probably June, just because you know, unless you're coming for the spring game next week, um, which will be likely June for. Uh, you know, camps and stuff, bring us some toots up here. We'd love to have some toots. We don't get that over here in East Tennessee, okay? Yes, sir, we'll do. Thank you, buddy.